Infinity. 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 What is infinity? Infinity is really cool. It's about as big as it gets. You can't really put a name to it because that limits it. Infinity, as I see it, refers more to the true nature of reality. No one and no thing has any kind of separate, inherent, or intrinsic nature. I'm a librarian, so I feel that infinity is my business. I connect words that were written a thousand years ago, uh, also words that were written last week. If there's an infinite number of possibilities, it means I have no limits as a composer or a performer. Every single note that I choose to play in a song, I could have played any of the other notes, or the notes between the notes, you know, like in the blues. Infinity is something that just goes on and on, and it's continuous. It does not have an endpoint. I can show you my experience of infinity. Infinity means numbers go on and on. Infinity, generally speaking, is a very precise mathematical concept. Infinity is a pure fiction, an optical illusion. Before Einstein, people believed that the speed of light is uh, infinity, it's instantaneous. Uh, and then Einstein explained it uh, into a uh, relativity theory, that the speed of light is finite. It's very, very fast, the, the light, but it's still finite. So analogously, the largest integer is very, very big, much bigger than the speed of light, but still finite. So what we will be talking about, we want to call a near infinity. It's something which actually does take place in our finite world, but it's so big and complicated that uh, complexity of it is uh, approaching infinity in practical terms. Now that we have computers, it's time to get rid of this illusion and start and doing completely, purely finite and discrete mathematics. Infinity is there to stay. I've spent years thinking about it, and I, I'm no wiser.